I'd seen uh, things on the news before about private industry employers, and I thought, well, why can't we do something like that here? I mean, we're as a crow flies, we're, we're less than a mile away from the Aylesworth Correctional Facility. Here we are, we're a sprawling company, but we didn't have the employee base to draw labor from here in Ellsworth County. So that's kind of where it all started, and we finally got the private industry contract. We've never looked back since then. I grew up rough, you know, because I didn't have my high school diploma. Came to prison, changed my life, man. I heard I could get my GED through Barton County. I said, okay, sign me up. You know, they have a lot of programs here at Ellsworth Correctional Facility. They have Thinking for a Change, and they have NA groups that come into the facility. The beauty of being here is that uh, Mr. Cox and the company allows you, if you want to, to learn anything. But he'll teach you, you know what I'm saying? Uh, in my yeah. interviewing process, he told me, I told him, man, I want to learn whatever you want to teach me. Yeah. He said, well, I'll teach you whatever you want to learn. So I thought that was great. Well, hey, the one thing about uh, being in metal fabrication and having these skills, man, they transcend. Uh, they, you can do them anywhere in the world. So, I mean, I'm developing works, workable skills, you no know, marketable skills. You know, these they go out and apply for different jobs, and they put me down for a reference, and these guys never have any trouble finding jobs. I've gotten out before with nothing, you know, with the $100 gate money. I've seen guys get out and have $100, and that's just a hotel and a meal. And... The beauty of it is, man, it gives me a an opportunity to leave here with some type of financial stability. You able to save some money to help you with that transition? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, it changed my life, man. I mean, I, by the time I get out of here, I'll be set. I will be okay. As far as reservations, as far as hiring people with a felony background, there's a lot of good guys that just simply made a bad choice at some point. Doesn't necessarily make them a bad person for the rest of their life. We human beings, man, we pay taxes. Some guys just send money home just to help their spouses, just to help pay bills. You know what I'm saying? We're trying to do the right things, you know what I mean? But in a lot of us, all we want and need is the opportunity. The lifestyle before, it wasn't real terrible. I was a disc jockey. I worked my tail off all my life. I went to college. I've done things all my life, but I would make one wrong decision and mess it all up. I'm gonna make sure that don't happen anymore. They've got so much to lose and nothing to gain by getting into trouble. So uh, they tend to be our best employees. In 2011, when I came to this facility, I had heard about this program. Yeah. And I had criteria to meet in order to get to this level, of course. Right. And it gave me hope to stay out of trouble. And it put me on the right path. Yeah. It really did. I mean, yeah. honestly, it did. If I didn't have the opportunity to come out here and do this, I don't know where I'd be at today. It's kind of been like a leaf in the wind to open the door. I'm, this is going to be a lot different this time. This is the best opportunity that I've ever heard of or seen that a person can have that's incarcerated to actually get a solid foundation underneath them. You know, a lot of people talk about Kansas prisons and Kansas prisons. I brag about it. I say, yeah, we got jobs. It would be great if every facility in the state of Kansas in the Department of Corrections had a private industry program. I'd like to see every guy have this opportunity. I'm gonna try to be as modest as I can. I like to think that I'm a success story. I was released 2018 of May. I did oh, seven girl. years in Ellsworth. Bought a house and I worked my tail off for it. The community has, has received me well. I have so many friends here now and it's a small community and I love it. And one of the things that we say is that, you know, we can do time. As long as you wake up every day, you can do time. But can you get out and live? Can you get out and become a productive member of society? Yes, I'm excited every day. I love coming to work. I love going home. The sky is the limit now. It's, it's like I can't sleep sometime at night because I'm so excited about how this art is it, it, really hill based. Why is this so emotional for you? Just uh, happy, happy that it works. And if you could just go over and over and over and over, people will get it right someday. And, and, and that's, that's what this has done. I know it can do it for many other people, and I know other people that's been successful. <laughs>